We simply insert our force sensitive resistor, plug it in, we open up the Arduino development environment, and we're getting a lot of zeros. That's because I'm not touching the sensor. But if I apply just a little bit of force, we're starting to get values. That's, that's exciting. Now, I designed a place for this sensor to go in the dogbot leg. Now, this is the, the foot of the new, log, the new dogbot design. And you'll, you'll see that it has a place right there for the dogbot sensor, the, the force resistor. And we also have this little raised area here to apply that force. To hold everything together, I'm using just these round head fasteners. I think that'll work nicely. And now I have a little bit of room to work with. So let's move over to the computer. And if I, if I plug this in, open up my serial monitor I'm getting a value of a hundred without applying any pressure if I apply some pressure I get a much higher value hmm Let me tinker with this so that I no longer get a value. There we go. Okay, now I'm getting zero. If I apply pressure, I get a high value. Okay, now we're going to turn on this scale. And I just teared it at zero grams with the foot on the scale. So if I take this scale up, I get negative 12 grams. So right now the foot is weighing 12 grams. I'm getting 13. Okay. If I apply pressure of let's say 400 grams, I'm getting 570 on the serial monitor. If I apply zero grams, I get zero. Now let me apply 1,000 grams. I'm getting around 700 on the serial monitor. And finally, let me apply 2,000 grams if I can. There we go, around 2,000 grams. And I'm only getting 780 on the serial monitor. So it's definitely a curve, but I think it's a good start. In the next episode, we will be adding more sensors to this foot. So I'll see you next time.